welcome back to my channel it's Naela so I know I might be looking a little crazy right now but we're going to put a wig on and today's video is sponsored by Unice Hair so thank you Unice for sending me this wig and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel you guys know the routine and if you guys are interested in seeing me install this wig please keep on watching you guys this wig is from Unice Hair like I said and it's in the color 1B427, so it's a ombre wig with dark roots. So this is a closure wig with a T-part lace. So this is called a T-part lace. So it has like this lace um, that is sewn in. It's like a fabric that is sewn in. So it's supposed to make the lace look more like scalp. So I'm going to show you guys how it looks from this side. So that's how it looks right here. And I... And I um and I bleached the knots on this wig, so the knots look pretty good. The knots bleach pretty good on this wig, so I'm happy about that. So this is how the wig is looking. I love the color. It's like dark roots, black, brown, and goes to blonde. So I really do like the coloring. And like I said, this is the inside. I did not get all the purple dye shampoo. It's supposed to basically help the knots um, not be like too orangey, so it helps that. So right now, oh yeah, this wig comes with three clips in the inside. I'm sorry y'all, my wig looks crazy. I just bleached the knots and just didn't even care about the inside. So you, know, you guys know I always cut off the um, clips because... It's just no reason for them. I don't use them. Now you guys, I put makeup on the part or on the front of the hair. I put on the Oreo True Match Super Blendable Powder in the color Warm. You can get this at Target. So, so I put that on my part. Well, on the front of the hair. Now I'm about to put it on my part. Because you can still see the knots. Which is so dumb. I'm like, why y'all put a whole fabric there to not see the knots? And then when you still put it on your scalp, you can still see the knots. Like, that don't make sense. So I'm going to put this. I'm just patting it in. Okay, that covers it up a little bit more. I am about to say, like, um, what's the point of the fabric? And I over plucked right here. So I'm just put some powder there just so I won't see the knots. But I'll put like some black spray right there so I'll cover it up. I'm the queen of over plucking. Okay. On accident, like I just be into it and then bam, a whole ball spot. Like. Okay, so that helps a lot. You just gotta literally like. press the powder in put this on like I said I did a whole tutorial it'll be up in the card so you guys can just hit it and go to the video that I used and I'll be using this um high insta hold free spray I love this but I feel like this is more for actually holding your hair down so you could use either one of these because this is really good and it holds your hair down really good so I like this better than the yellow one so I'm gonna use both of these and yep and i'm just letting y'all know because it's just going to be like a fast forward thing so yep we're going to get into the install part go outside big time forward the star boy dance Game the one replace me. Me love my energy, strip me no chaser. All of my guys know me, all about me paper. Me got me girls all around me, me no chaser. Yeah, star boy call me number one. When me tune drop, the girls they bounce along. Me know let nothing come between me and me paper. So when me come in, I place me on that take. Yeah, yeah. Number one in city. 
So as you guys can see, the lace is melted okay. So I really like it's got to be holy grail. It melts lace perfectly. And I'm so glad I found this powder, y'all. It matches my skin perfect. Like as you can see, my the top of my head by my forehead is darker. So that's perfect. So it's looking like scalp. So I'm just do the same to this side. I don't know if you guys seen, but using this razor, it's good because it makes it jagged, but it like put like a little, it went too far back. So I'm gonna try to use my scissors on this side just to be safe. I'm gonna cutting the lace and I'm gonna start in the back. And then, so I'm going to just use this. I spray it on like the end of my rat tail comb and put it on the lace where it needs to be melted a little bit more. And then I just like press it in. And another tip I've noticed is cutting close to the, la cutting like close to the hairline is when you can see like no lace is how you get your lace melted because you it's no lace so my thing I used to always like have a little extra lace but it's good to cut cut right right where the hair is so you won't see no lace and that's how you get the where's the lace well you have to have good lace one HD lace transparent lace and you have to cut close to the lace so you can't see the lace they don't tell you that part I just learned it from my last wig because, child, that wig, I put some work in. But, yeah, so you just have to cut close to the lace. Like, that is the install of this wig, y'all. <sighs> Looks pretty good. Your girl's getting quick, okay? Like I said, um, closures is easy, so that was a breeze. But now it's going to be time for styling. It came with some curls in it, but it was giving old lady vibes. So I don't know how I'm a curlist. Like I'm not no stylist. I was gonna straighten it, but I'm like, mm, it won't look cute straight. It'll look cute with curls. And then I was gonna cut it into like a long bob, which I think will look cute, but I don't know. So I might just put some curls. I like the little waves that it has in it, so I might just do that. I'm not sure yet. Okay, y'all, so I'm back. It's a couple days later, to be honest, because I didn't have time to finish it that day. So, here's my hair. I have curled it. I have, I just cut, it was already pre-cut, as you guys seen, but I just cut, like, a little bit using, like, the razor blade for the bang part. So, this is, like, when I put this in? I put it in Sunday. Today's Wednesday. So, I curled it Monday. So, this is, like, three-day-old curls a little bit so i've been pin curling the hair every night so it actually been staying a couple times the pin curls don't come out right so i have to go over it and recurl it in the morning so that's not bad but i'm gonna show you guys how i curl it because the first day the first day was actually really cute but since i've been pin curling it and stuff it's been lower like the curls fell so it's not as like how it was monday it was like wavy so I'm going to show you guys how I do it and curl it. But I did show you guys like the install for the most part. It's a regular closure wig. So you guys know how to do it. But one day I'm going to do another in-depth tutorial. Like an updated. Even though I'll be showing you guys a little bit. But so I'm going to show you guys how I curl this hair. Because it is curled a little bit. But it's not all the way curled. So yeah. So I do the front, so I'm 
So this side is pretty much done. So I'm going to do this side. But it's pretty good. But it's not as like curled as it should. So I'm going to do this front piece. And I'm going to show you guys how I do it. Yeah, I did do this piece this morning. But you know, I'm rushing going to work. So, But yeah, I comb it out. I really like this hair. I got so many compliments on the hair color and the hair. I like the length. It just gives like natural vibes. So I love this hair. Okay. For the front piece, this is what I do. I clamp my curler, twirl it back. Cause you want it to go back to keep like the same, just like the same curl. Cause you want the curl to kind of go back and come forward so and then I just drop it so you see how it's like in uniform and then I just like finger comb that out and then this is eh, the bottom's not actually right but the top is let me try it one more time let me just start it bit. Yeah. Well, so let me just okay. Let me just start over. And it took me a couple times to do this, y'all. Like this was not a one-time thing that I learned. I'm still learning, as you can see. I just watch YouTube videos to help me. So you're just like grab, grasping it, twirling it, and then I drop it at the ends. Yeah, the ends ain't acting right today. I pin curl it at night, so it usually stays through the night. So in the morning, I just take out the pin curls, and then it's good. So yeah, this front piece, I come all the way up. I twist it back. Okay, so the front piece, you're going to have to go like all the way through as you've seen. And then that brings the little curl by the end. So yeah, that's how I get the front piece. And then I just kind of comb it out a little bit. And yeah, that's how I get the front piece. It's not like perfect, perfect, but it does the job, okay? And I'm going to show you how I do one of the back pieces. So I'll do this piece right here. That's next to the front. And I just comb out the old curl. The other day, I was getting it. Like, Monday, I act I, I, like I knew what I was doing. Yeah, today is not acting right. I don't know why. But I wanted to get, I wanted to be like a wavy type of, of look. I didn't really want curls. Like, today is more curls, but Monday, it was waves. So yeah, I curl it like that and then I drop it at the ends. So I'm gonna just do this whole side over here. See like this curl is good, but it's long. Clamps it, I swirl it under. And you don't wanna keep it on there too long like you're doing an actual curl. And you want to get some of the ends and then I drop. Instead of curling the ends, I just drop it. So that's how I get my like wavy look that I had on Monday. And I'm going to do this piece. So it's like different type of ways you can do it. Like another girl I seen on YouTube she like doesn't even go all the way up with the hair she just comes to the ends and then just drop it like that but i don't know see like today it's not doing what it was doing monday see monday i had like actual waves but it's not bad 
Let me try it and I might have to actually like just curl it, curl it. Let me just leave it in one there a little bit. Cause this hair is a little long, so maybe if the hair was a little shorter or a, like in a bob kind of length, I would leave it not on there a long time. Yeah, so if you leave it on there longer, the curl will be a little tighter. So that's the way I like it. Cause I don't want it to look I don't want it to look like too that's like too big of a piece. I don't want it to be like too super long. Cause I want it to give like a little bit of bob vibes. So what I also did with the hair is I cut the hair like it was a little straggly so I just cut it just so it could be even on each side. So yeah that's how I get the curls. This side was already perfect so I just left it alone. And yeah that's how I get the curls. And at night I just pin curl it. And yep that's how I get my hair curled. So I really do like this hair so much. I like the color at first I'm like uh, I don't know. I really do like the color. The T part lace is just easy to work with. It's already a pre-colored lace, so I like that. And you just I just put some concealer on it so it looks like my scalp color. And other than that, it looks good. Very natural. And this is the left. I'm gonna show you guys. I hope you guys can see. Yeah. So it's a good length. It's, it looks natural. That's what I like. But I got so many compliments. It compliments my skin. I love it. So I'm just come back and finish this video off. I just want to get dressed a little cuter. And then we can end this video. Okay, guys. So I'm back dressed. I ain't going to wear. I just want to get cute. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you to Unice for sponsoring this video. I absolutely love this wig. I love the color. I love the length. It's just giving girl woman vibes. I love it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, enjoyed the curling tutorial and everything. So make sure to go get this wig, guys. Like, if you want to look like this, it don't even cost that much. Just go check out the link and buy this wig. You get it right off Amazon, get it in one to two days. If you have Prime, y'all get this wig. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye. Oh, 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 oh,